Hey, what's up you guys? This is Junior Trader and in this video we are taking a look at Tesla stock. Guys, I'm so excited, so happy. This thing is another $10 up today and it's at the time of doing this video which is the morning time. We are 242, just hit $242 on Tesla guys. This is unstoppable. Let's take a look at in this video what is the price action telling us. You know, when Tesla moves, it moves, right? It, it Once it picks up the direction up or down, right? When it picks the direction to the downside, you know, this thing can run down, right? I mean, it can just go to the crater, to the ground, uh, even dig a, dig a hole for itself, right? But when it goes up, I mean, this thing just goes up then, right? There's just no stopping this thing. So, as we have been talking about from last couple of days and weeks and even month, that overall structure has been uh, on Tesla very bullish and especially with when I go to the weekly interval especially wow look at this weekly beautiful candle guys especially this lower channel that Tesla was in for more than a year after we formed this inverted head and shoulder over here that was it right and this was the confirmation as I was talking guys as long as we are above this 162 area this green box that I have put down there this is just an inverted head and shoulder on the longer time frame and on the weekly interval this is looking great to to rock it up eventually it did that guys now not only this thing has been going up on the weekly interval this this well okay so today will be a shorter day for the trading and due to the uh tomorrow's uh we have fourth of july tomorrow the the uh, united states uh day off for the independence day and uh, we are in this week already above 200 weeks moving average as well guys like sentiment is full on bullish now i forgot to tell you before going further that none of this is any financial advice and it's only for education purposes please do your own thing guys i'm just sharing my opinion here we also have now price targets being raised right because that's what happens when the price moves and start taking out the previous targets all all of them will come later Oh, it's a buy now. It's a buy now, right? And you can go through the articles, guys, but many of them are now saying, oh, yeah, it's a buy. It's going to go to this target up, 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 right? But they are nowhere to be found when there's when there's the time to buy. And I have been building my position. You know that from very on, from very these places. And I have been calling out this is a bullish structure. If you see my videos, you know beforehand what to even look for in the price action rather than these analysts who come later and when the price has made the move, then they come and tell you to buy. What's the point, right? The, the meat of the move is pretty much made its move, right? But hey, it doesn't mean that Tesla is going to just tap out air or it's just the end of the run. That's what we'll take a look at in the price action here, guys. It's a oh, wow, 243. Am I seeing any sign of uh, sell-off or a consolidation or a downside on this? No, I'm not seeing in any of the single candle right now, not even in the price action price structure. There is no downside in the horizon right now unless it starts forming and we'll talk about it when I see that. But Tesla is not going to plummet then just one day and one red candle comes and just falls. No, that's not going to happen. If any pullback, bigger pullback has to come, you will see a distribution phase. And that's plenty of time to get out of this long position. At least for me, I built my long position on Tesla. And I have to say, like, I have a habit of taking partial profits. And yes, I have been taking out partial profits. I also took out very little today as well in partial profits. I just want to feel that fun and enjoyment that okay, I'm booking my profits. I still have like 70% or 75% around my position on the long-term portfolio that I'm planning to hold. But I'm just like, okay, let's just take some partial profits, right? Because I just want to lock in some profits, right? So, yeah. So right now, price action, guys, is full-on still bullish. You know, uh, I'm not seeing any, you know, downside on this. Even yesterday, I talked about if any pullback comes, if it comes, this thing is just a buy, right? So let's go to the hourly interval. I mean, this is just doing a pullback to a one of our levels, right? And then just got bought back up. Again, my indicator marks these automatic, you know, levels. I mean, marks levels automatically. If you need access to my tools, links are in the description below. I also have bots 
Let's take a look at uh, how my bot is doing on Tesla today. Let's see. So overall, we have been net profitable and let me actually turn that on. Yep, today also was a good buy position. You can see the data on the left side of on the table, guys, net profitable for the last 30 trades. Again, the calculations are based off of how much position I have entered, which is a smaller position in the settings of the bot. You can, if you have access, you can accordingly change the position and see the calculations for yourself. But yeah, today also good, good buy position and first sell position has already come on the day trading as well. There are two more sell positions that going, I mean, which is like take partial profits positions. Two more will be coming later. We'll see when that comes. But uh, yeah, so today also net profitable day and uh, also for the last 30 trades. Again, if you need access to my tools, links are in the description below of this video. Again, these are only educational tools. I take guarantee of nothing. Data, I just showed you the data. I showed the data in all the videos. You know, uh, use them at your own risk and responsibilities. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not telling you something that I don't show you here. All right. I sh I, what I tell you is what I show you on the screen. All right. So now we where's the next target that we can go to right so I have been talking about this 265 since the video yesterday because that's where I see some next level of resistance so there is a likelihood that 265 is the possibility their price target 300 and you know Kathy was all up at 2000 I'm not sure about 2000 guys that's too far away for me uh, I would more likely be happy with these levels like 265 and I'll take some partial profits along the journey guys um, you know, I'm, I'm not going to take more partial profits today because I don't want to just liquidate all of my position. You know, I want to just take some, you know, keep some more meat for when I see distribution, then I'll take some more out. Like if I see the distribution phase, but yeah, guys, um, right now, no sign of slowing down on Tesla. And, um, yeah, if, if I see any break of structure, I'll talk about it. And I definitely want to see how the day also closes, but it's already at what, like $11 up, like 243 almost. So, uh, I mean, what do I tell you more? Like it's guys bullish. There is no structure to the downside. Pullbacks on this are just a buy even on day trading. And my swing bot has also been giving partial profits. Now my swing bot gave the buy position down here. If you, if, again, if you have access to my tools, you know that very well. And it's now just riding the wave, guys. My swing bot is just riding the wave. All right, well, guys, I'm excited. I'm super happy. Tech stocks are down today. Look at it, the red stuff. However, Tesla is the one taking the market higher. NVIDIA is also red today. All right, I'll be doing NVIDIA video as well real quick soon today. But uh, what else do we have here, guys? Yeah, everything is bullish. I mean, guys, it's the time to enjoy, have party. All those times of turbulences are gone. That's the really the time when you're, you know, you test your skills, you test your perseverance, discipline, right? And yeah, I, I know it was, uh, I mean, I was on always alert that, okay, I'm building my position here. I need to have my stop loss around these areas or whatnot, setting my, you know, stop limit losses, sorry, stop losses on my stop limit orders, everything. And once you get, the, yeah, this is amazing. Now I'm just enjoying the ride, taking partial profits every day. Yeah, this is amazing. But that's what trading is all about. There are times of take profit. There are times of building position. There are times of stress as well. That's the stress is the learning experience that you go through in the market because, you know, uh, it's the experience that you have to gain through the stressful times in the market. And guys, nothing is guaranteed in stock market. Always have a stop loss and you build for that's why stop losses are important because what if the other case, right? But you maximize your reward potentials like this because you trade with the structure that's how to do it and i'm here to teach you and educate you again i don't take guarantee of anything i'm just here to educate you how to best manage your portfolio how to trade where the stop losses should be like how to see the structures and how to take the positions at the end of the day decisions are yours outcomes are yours all right i'll see you in my next videos guys take care bye